Hey, yeah, hiccups. Jeanette Davila recalls the excruciating pain she endured before being diagnosed with a brain tumor. At first, it started feeling almost like migraine headaches. And then as I got into my third trimester, I started feeling like a really bad pounding feeling in my head. The 30-year-old was pregnant with her twins at the time, which made the experience even more terrifying. Nothing worked as far as medications. And at one point, she lost her peripheral vision. Around January is when I started noticing that I, I couldn't see. Doctors at Cleveland Clinic found the tumor. It was about the size of a tangerine and pushing on her optic nerves. Pituitary tumors, generally speaking, are benign, but some of the effects even uh, cause lifelong deficits or problems. Due to the size and severity, Jeanette went into surgery right away. Getting the news while you're expecting is definitely scary, but I remain positive and I felt I was in good hands. As Dr. Pablo Racinos explains, he and a team of surgeons devised a plan to go in through her nose to remove the brain tumor. The procedure was successful. Most people would think that uh, a brain surgery involves making an opening in the skull, but that's not always the case. A week later, Jeanette delivered her twins, Noah and Juliet, via C-section. And as you can see, they're happy and healthy. They're very good kids, very good babies. And they finally sleeping throughout the night. <laughs> One of many reasons to be grateful these days. For Cleveland Clinic, I'm Brittany Harris.